Okay, boys and girls, so we are going to read the story for science day two, week three. Yesterday, we did a math extension activity where we had to figure out who came in first, second, third, fourth place in the colors of the car. But today is just a simple reading and answering the 10 questions. So if you click on the week three, make sure you click on the new tale reading story. This is for Tuesday. Um, click it. It will download below. Once it's ready, it'll pop up. So um, you're going to be reading about a dolphin rescue. This story is called A New Tale. Dolphin Rescue. Scientists make a new tale for a dolphin. So this should be very interesting. Um, as always, I might ask you some questions, so comment below. And hopefully when I see you guys, you can. Uh, I will be tallying up how many of you get answers correctly. And I will give you a special prize for that. So meet Winter. Winter is a four-year-old dolphin. She lives at the Clearwater Marina Aquarium in Clearwater, Florida. Unlike other dolphins, Winter has a prosthetic tail that was made just for her. A prosthetic body part is a fake part that is used in the place of a real one. So uh, this dolphin over here, she has a fake tail, maybe because it either fell off or it got attacked or uh, maybe it was just born without a tail. So a prosthetic is a fake body part that could be used in place of an, a, a real one. So that's pretty cool. We'll learn more about her. Dolphins move their tails up and down to swim. Winter had to swim side to side. Now that she has a new tail, she can swim as other dolphins do. Why did Winter need a new tail? In 2005, she got caught in a crab crap line, uh, trap line and needed to be rescued. A crab trap line is a cord used to lift a crab trap out of the ocean. The cord damaged Winter's tail and made it fall off. She was only three months old. Wow, that's a baby. Many people thought she would not survive. Dolphins need to move their tails up and down to swim. And this is just a photo of um, what she got caught in. So it says a crab trap is used to catch crabs in the ocean. The traps can be very a bit big danger to dolphins and other ocean animals. So, making a new tail. Scientist Kevin Carroll heard about winter. He makes prosthetic parts for humans. I thought to myself, that poor dolphin, says Carroll. Then I thought, that's what we do. We replace missing body parts. Why not a dolphin? And this is a picture of winter playing with another dolphin at the Clearwater Marina Aquarium. Carroll and his team tried many ideas. Finally, they made a new teal tail that worked. It is made of a special material that works well with winter's sensitive skin. The tail is placed over a gel-like material that helps hold it in place. The new tail lets winter move quickly through the water. She is now able to swim like a dolphin again. And this is what it looks like. Winter's prosthetic tail includes flukes, Flukes are parts, are the parts at the end of the tail. And it shows you a little diagram, a picture. And here are our questions. What is a prosthetic, prosthetic body part? If you don't know, it's right up top. So make sure you refer to the story when answering these questions. In 2005, Winter's tail was damaged and fell off. What was the effect of Winter losing her tail? So that's a cause and effect. Remember, boys and girls, when we did cause and effect? Because Winter's tail was damaged and fell off, tell me what happened. Because it would was damaged and fell off. So because Winter's tail was damaged and fell off, what happened after that? She could swim faster? She could not swim at all and had to stay still? She had to swim differently or she could swim better, which was the effect of her damaged tail and when it fell off. 
Then you have to read these sentences from the text. So read this. And then it says, based on this information, what can you infer about the importance of a dolphin's tail? Inferred means just what can you tell me about this sentence? What, what do you get off from, from that? Read the sentences from the text again. So now you're going to read this one. And um, you're going to, based on this information, you're going to tell me what ideas Carol and his team tried before they made a tale that worked. What were some of the things they tried before they made it work? And you're going to get that information right from here. What is the main idea of this text? So what is the main what is the main idea of this whole story? What is it all about? What is it teaching you? The lesson? What is the main idea? Number six. At the end of the passage, there is an illustration, there's a picture of Winter's prosthetic leg. Why might the author have included this illustration? Why do you think the author put this picture in the story? What is he trying to do when he's showing you this picture? And your choices are he's trying to um, show the readers how Winter's prosthetic tail is better than a real tail. Is he telling you that how a real tail is better than Winter's prosthetic leg tail? Or is he telling you or he's showing the reader what Winter's prosthetic tail looks like? Is he showing the reader what all prosthetic tails look like? What is he trying to do? Seven, all you're going to do is read that sentence and then you're going to tell me replace that word finally with a different sentence, a different word that means finally, before, initially, even though, or at last, which one means finally. Number eight, what does Winter's new tail letter do? Full complete sentence. Winter's new tail lets her blah, 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 blah. Tell me what Winter's tail, uh, new tail does. Winter's prosthetic tail includes flukes. Give two more details from the text about the materials that Carol and his team included in pro Winter's prosthetic tail. Support your answer with the evidence. So good. You're going to tell me what materials they use to make Winter's tail. And you're going to use it. Um, you're going to say Carol and his team use many materials to make uh, Winter's tail. And you'll tell me on in the in one paragraph it says the tail blah blah blah, blah and tell me the materials they use. Make sure you use evidence because it's asking you for evidence. And number ten, Carol and his team tried many ideas before finally making a tail that worked. Based on the text, make an inference about one thing Carol and his team had to think about when making a tale that would help Winter swim like a dolphin again. Use evidence to support your, your, uh, your answer. So please make sure you use the story to answer this question. Just tell me uh, one thing that Carol and his team had to think about when making a new tale for Winter. Like, what came to their mind? What did they have to take into consideration? And use the evidence to support you. So as always, you can uh, write in this document, print this out, and send me pictures. Or just write the answers in your notebook and then just take a picture as well. So that's assignment two for week three.